Let's get into Vitalik Buterin talking yesterday in an interview about the merge. I got to put my headphones on here. We got headphones in the house. And now we listen to Mr. Vita. Let me see what the, the audio is like. Let's make sure it all sounds good. Let's get into it right here. Boom. Vitalik Buterin on Ethereum switch to proof of stake. I see what it was. All right, let's get into it. Um, I mean, I think at this point, it basically is testing, right? You know, like at, at this point, um, you know, there are already some um, like basic test nets and like full implementations of uh, like everything that needs to happen for the merge. Like there's uh, implementations of the consensus clients. There was uh, implementations of the like what we call execution clients now. So like the Geth and Nethermind are the, like, the bigger ones. Um, and uh, Peter Salagi, the lead uh, Ge dev of uh, Geth, I just like, tweeted out a few days ago that like Geth is basically one PR away from being uh, uh, ready for the merge, right? So like PR means pull request. It's just basically a big piece of code that gets uh, kind of suggested to be added to um, the the Geth project, and then it'll actually be uh, added and included at some point uh, fairly soon. Um, so. The, but obviously, like there, there's still quite a bit of testing left to go. Um, the piece that has seen like the least testing and where there's still some finishing touches uh, being done on right now is the like in what we call the initial sync process. So this is like when a node joins the network for the first time. Then like how do they yeah, like d basically download the kind of what the existing states, so like what the existing like account balances, contract code, and all of those things are. Um, mm -hmm. So that they can then kind of be part of the network and uh, go from there. And there's just like some subtleties and kind of the, the interaction between, you know, how the proof, the formerly proof of work side does it and how the proof of stake side does it. Um, so like a bunch of, uh, a bunch of technical stuff there, though also huge amounts of progress uh, being made on it. Um, so I think generally people are feeling uh, very good about the merge right now. It's just uh, you know, a bunch of technical work, a bunch of testing, um, a bunch more testing. Um, and, uh, you know, hopefully we're going to be merging pretty soon. Okay. Obviously the, the big question is when do you think that that'll happen? Um, I mean, some people are saying June, some people say, I uh, saying July or August. I don't know. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> some people say in June, some people say in July or August. I don't know. <laughs> why doesn't he know i don't know i'm feeling a delay like it like if the if the answer is some people say june some people say july or august i don't know um i'm feeling i'm feeling a delay are you guys feeling a delay i'm feeling a delay that was not confidence inspiring if i'm looking at this from a stakeholder i'm like oh that's, <laughs> that's, that's how I would feel about it. It's very weird. Um, but I mean, everything else like checks out as far as like the way he approaches things and like answers interview questions, etc. Um, what do y'all think? Let me know in the comment section and reply, of course, and we'll go over those later. I'm thinking it sounds like to me, more like July or August or August, which is interesting. But, you know, the the Geth pull request, only needing one more pull request for it to be ready for the merge, that's a big deal because that's going to be a majority of pretty much everything that needs to function on Ethereum. And so uh, that being so close is, uh, from the perspective of the actual merge taking place, is positive and pretty close. I hope you enjoyed this clip from the Crypto Mining Morning Show every Monday through Friday, 7.45 a.m. Pacific and 10.45 a.m. Eastern Time. You can check out more clips here, or if you're interested in checking out the entire live show, you can check that out down here. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next Tuesday.